Alrighty, so I was recording, at least I thought I was recording, when suddenly I realized that the little fraps counter was purple, not red, and I realized, no, I'd just been talking to myself for the last ten minutes. So, oh, that still sounds so loud. Crank it down. There we go. Okay, so anyway, as I was saying, I realized I've been talking to myself for the last 10 minutes and that you guys have absolutely no idea what I'd done. So, I'll go back over it. I gave Hamus the ring and the crown. Yes, I just did that in reverse order. Go me. And I'm sending him off to Baleem to return them to the crazy man in the museum, Indiana Jones. Dimitri, on the other hand, is headed to the supply depot and he's headed there because once he gets there, we'll be able to pick up Dr. Pippin's papers, and I believe we then have to take him back to the hospital. But what we can do, because we can get a bit done in this episode, I'll, you know, first I'll go back over this. Okay. So, I've put the squads over here, because I don't want what happened last time to happen, where I get dragged into the next zone, instead of the zone I was in. Because I thought that Squad Alpha was in here in the actual city, but it turns out that they weren't. That was kind of a lie on the part of the game. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move them back a little bit, so we're not quite on the minefield, but we'll be near where the tank was, because I don't want them to die again. Because that would be very, very bad. Oh yeah, these guys. Uh, you know, I will send them directly to the actual hideout. At least, that's where I think it is. I think it's about there. We'll, we'll stop outside the mountain thingy. That'll do. Anywho, uh, we'll go over the squad loadout. Not really much changed, I just divvied up the ammo and that sort of thing, but what we did find that was kind of cool was we found one of these, a G11. Now, these were the guns that that guy in the Baleem slums was offering to sell me for lots and lots and lots of money. It's not a bad gun. It's actually a, yeah, it's actually a pretty good gun, because it's sort of like an assault rifle that's an SMG. And it's, it's really handy, but it fires a very specific set of ammunition. 4.73 mil ammunition, to be specific. And we found 60 rounds of it here, and Static bought 100 rounds of it from um, Meduna. Which I can't remember how exactly we found it in Meduna. Though granted, it's been a day or two since I played that last set. Oh, and hopefully this will be the last set. We can just get the palace done. Because I'm not going to do any more missions after we've returned those papers to Doc Willis. Well... Okay, we won't do any more missions, apart from the ones that we've already undertaken, except for maybe the bounty hunting, if it is indeed that guy who's sitting in Maduna City. Because that's nice and close, we can just leave Vince up here and send uh, Alpha or something to go shoot him in the face. So that would be the last thing that we do. Ticks a prison? Meh. Actually, that's the last major location that we haven't taken. I will probably come back and do that in a special episode if you guys actually want to see how it works. But apart from that, I'm not interested in doing it. You don't get anything for it, and there's nothing cool. There's a junkyard up here where there was a city in um, Jagged Alliance 2. Again, not massively interesting. It's just a junkyard. It's only got like four people guarding it, and it's not really interesting. And the roadblock. Meh. What's the point? We don't need it. I might, maybe, send all the freebie squad members to take it out. Like Vince and Dimitri and these two. And Hamus. See if they can take it out. But probably not. So yeah. Um, that's the only real change. The other thing that's a little bit concerning is that... Um, Wolf is actually out of grenades for his grenade launcher. So what I might do is I'll send Alpha back over here because we've got to wait until Dimitri goes and gets uh, his thing anyway. So I'll send Watch Alpha back over there and we'll see if they can't um, scrounge up some more grenades for his grenade launcher, Watch seeing as we use them all. Now I'm 99% sure that I've fixed what was wrong with the game. I'm pretty certain that it was just uh, some registration error 
registry. But hopefully, seeing as this is the last set, it won't show up too much, and we'll just be able to finish the game in a timely manner. Not that I'm not liking the game. The game is brilliant. Well, what next? it's not Jagged Alliance 2 with uh, 1.33. 1.13, sorry. Granted, okay. it's not that. But okay. I don't think it was ever meant to be. Got I think it, it was a reimagining, like Battlestar Galactica was a reimagining. The new series, obviously. Got so, it. I like it. I really do like it. That's it's fun. Moving. Um, but yeah, like... I will be glad to uh, to finish the LP, only because it'll give me a sense of I've completed it. There. And it was my first one, so, you know, that that's pretty cool. So, here are the documents for Dr. Pippin's notes. The Harvester of Sorrow. So, we found Dr. Pippin's notes and secured the shipment of weapons. I didn't get enough time to read that. What's our next bit of it? Okay, it's solved. Oh yeah, and this is a mission that you have one day to finish. And by one day, it actually means you have to have it finished by midnight. Luckily, well, you have to pick up the papers by midnight. Luckily, because where we were um, down in the maze meant that because we'd cleared the road and we'd taken out the gas station, we were able to make uh, Dimitri get up there quick enough. So he made it with about 17 minutes to spare. Uh, if the Queen does retake this place, if you've secured it but you haven't uh, gone as far as I had, obviously, and she manages to get a squad past you and retake the uh, supply depot, you lose. You can't stop it. So, what do we have to do? Show the notes to Dr. Willis. He may know how to prevent more harm from being done. Okay, that's nice and easy. So, we'll send Dimitri. And I can select his squad. There we go. Dimitri, I need you to... Oh, that's weird. I need you to go back to the hospital. And seeing as we're here, I'm pretty sure that this is where the T-Rex guy is. So, load the level. I'm almost like 99% sure that this is where he is. Because we saw a guy when we came through San Mona the first time, who had one of those funky little uh, dots. And it wasn't a quest marker. So, where to? Got it. hence my assumption. Yep, he's right in there. I'm on Come on, it. Vince. Go make me some money. Actually, okay. Move I'll see it. if uh, Tony, I think it was Tony, who's the one As who's here, I has hear. any grenades, and I'll send Vince down with them. Enemy. Oh, damn it! You will take me alive. Shit. Kill him. Nice. Yep, you've brought T-Rex to justice. Ooh, yes please, I want it. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme. I'm probably never gonna use it, but it's cool. I will take those stun grenades though. Um, Actually, no, we won't take that ammo, we don't need it. We might okay. sell it though. Got it. Yeah, because we need the money. I do. We need the money, for definite. Okay, so... As you wish. Let's go see Tony. As you wish. Is the door already open? Yes. I hear. I think it was Tony. One of these guys is Roger the ammo that. dude. As you wish. Hello. I'm on it. Are you just the gunman? Jesse. Jesse, do you have any grenades? Yes, you do. Awesome. Uh, in that case, you can have this gun. Um. We won't need all of those, so you can have them as well. Uh, 15 should be more than enough. If we need more than 15, I'm a little bit worried about how good we actually are. Um, don't need any of that ammo, don't really need any of that either. Uh, no, don't really need anything here. Now we'll see what the other fellow has. Roger that. Okay. Oh, you, you just open the Moving. door, open the door. I'm on it. Hello. You just pretty much have guns, don't you? Yes. So nothing particularly interesting. Okay, then we don't need anything. Uh, I'll just check that I did do the mission. Rich people make good customers. 
or rich people who are rich customers. I can't remember which one it was. Yep, yep, we went back and he gave us, uh, he gave us the money. Even though he shortchanged us, that bastard. And Brenda's in here somewhere, happy with her magazine, I think that's her. Okay. So we've done that, uh, Vince, I need you. Really? Oh, only seven hours. Yeah, do that. Awesome. So he can head that way. Oh, but he might end up going through the junkyard. Okay, if he ends up going towards the junkyard and there's not many people there, I will try to take it with just Vince. How many people are here? One level two, three level fours, and one level five. Hmm. Yeah, why not? Ooh, we got a message. Email from Ooh, Bobby Ray. To say that you've got more money and you can spend it at my shop. Mm, no. But I do like this. I do like the Barrett. The Barrett's pretty cool. Although it costs 12,500, which is a fair bit. The, the automatic rocket rifle that we picked up for free off Brenda, that costs something like 22,000. And that's without, like, Express or anything like that. I'll just check there's nothing cool here. Because we're totally going to get a chance to use it. You know what? I will order some of these. I will order 12. No, I'll order 18. I'll spend 101,000 just to get me some vests that I'll probably never use. Um, uh, we don't need anybody else. I highly doubt that we could possibly lose this game at this point. We might lose Vince. <laughs> uh dear. Well, actually, let's have a look. Let's get him some equipment. What what can he do? Uh oh, he's a really, really bad shot. Okay, yeah, Vince. In that case, we're just gonna bypass it. I thought he had a little bit better uh, marksmanship than that, but it turns out I was wrong. So we will just skip that. Just get down to there. There you go. Oh, hang on, it says there's another email. Oh, right, okay, for our order. It's been processed. Awesome. Uh, Golf is headed back over here. So it'll take about the same time, so Vince should get down here about the same time that these guys do. Uh, these guys have pretty much arrived at their destination. I did remember to give one of them the key, didn't I? I hope so. Yes, I did the secret hideout key. This is basically just because we've almost finished the game. I'm just going to show you where a couple of the secret things are before we finally launch our assault on the uh, the Queen's mm -hmm. domain. So the hideout itself is over here. Understood. It's got this little fiery thing here. Ready. So if we just spin the camera, on it. Open door with key. So there okay. you go. You can pick that lock, I believe. If you've got uh, static or someone here, I think, but it might also be one of those ones like uh, the supply station, supply uh, depot where Elliot was. Well, Elliot's key opened that door anyway. Elliot was in Maduna, but it might be like that where you can only open the door once you've got the key. But got this is worth doing if uh, you yes, haven't found the Honko flakes and stuff Fine. because you won't be not swimming in money, you'll have money, but Skyrider left you 20,000 Oroko bucks, which are kind of useful. So she can pick up that Beretta, and that, and that, and why not, we'll take the shotgun too. I don't really need any of this stuff, but hey, why not? So, they can head... They can join up with um, Hamus at Belim. So in five hours he'll get there. In about seven, we'll get um, our grenades and such. Oops. So that's not too bad. Squad has arrived at target. 
So we'll go see if this merchant has anything that we need. If he has some armor, we'll probably grab that as well. Not that we particularly need it, but hey, every little bit helps. Go over there. So we'll send Thor. And the delay will be good because we can heal up Wolf. After his hole, I will run into things and die horribly, horribly. Um. Oh yeah, and we found some more rockets for Iggy's rocket gun. Even though he probably won't need them, they might be good as a bunker buster sort of thing. Oh hey, a case. Because I'm assuming... I can't remember exactly, but I'm assuming that the palace has some sort of organized defenses that revolve around strong points and that sort of thing. So, we're going to take the absolute best equipment that we possibly can. Okay. So even if it seems a little bit like overkill, I'm calling it worth it. Because while we could probably take the palace, like we did the maze with six people, I really don't want to, so I want to have as much redundancy built into it as I possibly can get. So we could sell stuff to him, but we don't really need to. He's got some cool things. And he's got a G82, but we don't really need it. I'm happy with the way everyone's performing with their um, their PGs. Could get another machine gun. Uh, we don't really need it. We're doing pretty damn well on our uh, on the equipment front. Hmm. No, we don't really need any of that stuff either. Okay, we found some caseless. We could use the. Uh, we could use the G11. I don't particularly like it though because it does shoot so fast. But this we can take. This we want. So the three with the most shot up to sh the most shot to shit armor. Which be you. Uh, your armor's okay. You need more. So here you go, Wolfie, Iggy. Oh, that's why he died to a one-shot. I forgot that he didn't have any armor. That would explain it. Uh, yeah. Iggy needs the gut. Iggy needs the other one. So... Oops. There you go, Iggy. And then throw it away. Throw it away. And Wolfie. Nice. Throw it away. Okay, well, he doesn't really need to carry all this stuff either. So we'll dump a little bit of it. Mm. We haven't really got anyone to dump it on. Oh, buns. Buns will do. Here you go. Give that to Thor. Give that to Thor. And carry wolves. Hmm. Take those bandages. And that crowbar. Yeah. Seems okay, and even though we don't really need to sell it, just for completion. There you go. You can have those. Um, yeah, so it turns out he doesn't actually have any of those grenades that we wanted. But that's okay. Hmm. We don't really need any more armor. We're pretty well set. Yeah. We, do we don't need it. See, are there any guns that we want to take with us? Nope. Oh, did we stockpile any of it here? I can't remember if we stockpiled any grenades. We might have used them all. Yeah, we used them all. Oh, that military intel is for Conrad as well, if I haven't already mentioned it. So if you find five of them, and they're all scattered around Alma and Belim, if you find five of them, um, he goes, I will join you in your cause, because you have done me a service. And you go, sweet, let's roll. And he goes, yes, let us. Um, I'll just check that everyone in the... Ooh, everyone should reload too. I'll just check that everybody in... Awaiting orders. Uh, Delta and that have a hollow sight if they need it. No, static needs one. Yeah, static needs one. 
So yep. Thor, please gather that hollow side for me. Cheers. So the reflex side is good, but the hollow side does it better. So it's a better thing to have. Uh, we don't really need any of those ACOG sites. Nope, nope, we're done. We are done. Uh, Sydney, you need to swap over to this, though. Just carrying so many... Everyone's carrying so much stuff. It's, it's lots and lots and lots of stuff. Okay, we are ready to head back. So let's go back to the maze. Now we need to get some zoom in on that. There we go, we want to head back to that bit of the maze. So, the final 68 of Didrana's troops are holed up in the palace. I'm assuming that this is a strong point. We probably have to fight the whole way through there. Although, that beach, that might be an opportunity. That might be an opportunity. Alright, we'll have to see how it goes. So, I'll fast forward. There's nothing else to do at the moment. Squad has arrived at target destination. Squad has arrived at target destination. Squad has arrived at target destination. Awesome. So we're at the Cambry University and Hospital. Mm. Dimitri, I require you go to go see the, the doc. Standing right there. Come on, go, 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 go. Run faster, you bastard. Copy that. Click. Copy that. Roger that. Copy that. Hello, Doctor. Any news on Dr. Pippin? Did you find him at the laboratory? I did, and I collected his papers after I shot him, and then I had to go liberate a city. I had to go liberate a goddamn city just to get the key for these papers. You better be appreciative. Indeed, you're more than a hard gun. Let me see. This is crazy. More crazy than I thought. I can't thank you enough. You well, know what kind of disaster you prevented from happening. I'll make sure no, not your really. efforts were not in vain. I'll get on the phone right away. Cheers. Cheers, bro. Alright, so we'll end that conversation. And he didn't give anything to us. Presumably, he's thinking, yes, they did this out of their own goodwill. Partially. But I was hoping for a bit of a prize. No matter, we can get a prize from this man. Squad has arrived at target destination. This man has a prize. I'm sure he does. He's Indiana Jones. He always has a prize. Mm -hmm. Okay. There he is. Okay. Eldwin, I believe his name is. Bueno. Go say hello. Tell him we found things. I'm on it. If I remember correctly, he's the one who was going on about knights. Well, bravely brave Sir Robin we may be, but apart from that, I like I how he's cleaned up the, the bodies. Noble knight would prevail. Oh, hello. As a reward, receive this mighty weapon and the undying gratitude of the gods. May both spell destruction to your enemies. Seeing as the answer is, holy shit, where did you get this? I want to know what he gave me. What did you Enjoy give me? Enjoy the power of the Thunder God. Thunder Child! May blood spill and bones break whenever you fire your magical cannon of fire and destruction. May the gods be with you, son. Thank you, Dr. Jones. What did you give me? Holy shit. <laughs> okay. There are two automatic rocket rifles you can get for free. And apparently a whole bunch of C4. Cool. So he just gave me an automatic rocket rifle with two full reloads. And about... He gave me six C4? Thank you, Dr. Jones. You have done me a great service. Even though I probably won't use those things ever again. It's still cool. It's still cool. So we'll move you back to the SAM station, I guess. Seeing as there's not really much else to do. Oh, Vince can be the bounty hunter as well. 
That's cool. Alrighty, so let's go see um, Carmen. Tell him we did the thing. Awaiting orders. We got such a cool gift. Hang on, does Dimitri have explosive skill? Because if he does, no. Not enough. I was going to finally blow that hole in the wall. But we didn't have enough ex XP and explosives to do it. That's okay. He can run along the alleyway instead. 